Our Genesis Narrows has spent the afternoon checking out the areas dealing with the most snow. Yeah, she joins us now live from Florence. What are you seeing, Jenna? Hey, Paula, Kyle, we are live in Florence and you can see it's snowing. It's starting to build up here on our car and you can see it right here on the ground starting to pick up a little bit. As for uh, traffic conditions, I want to point you in the direction of the road. You can see cars are going slow. They are being mindful of these slick roads. And even on our drive here, we were just in Grant County around the four o'clock hour. Uh, we passed our fair share of salt trucks on 75. If you follow me on Twitter, I shared a video of the drive where you can see the snow build up on that far left lane and uh, I can tell you drivers were avoiding that lane entirely. Now crews in Kentucky, they have been treating highways and side roads with assault brine since Tuesday. A spokesperson with Kentucky's transportation cabinet says leading up to today, crews have focused heavily on the cut in the hill area because if that area backs up, KYTC says it is a ripple effect for congestion problems. Crews stockpiled 16,500 tons tons of salt and over 26,000 gallons of brine for de-icing in Boone, Kenton and Campbell counties. If we ever get down on salt, we replenish um, our maintenance facilities. Can Over our 11 districts, we have 31 tons at there. So everything's stocked up, the brine, calcium chloride, and uh, drivers who, who know what they're doing. We have some folks out with sickness but we have shuffled around and uh, planned for that. So we feel confident in our snow removal efforts for today. And we're also just right around the corner from the Florence Mall, which is where one of the gravity diagnostics testing locations are. That's one of the drive throughs. And as we've been reporting throughout this whole week, you know how long those lines are. And I can tell you, even with the snow, people are still in line there. Uh, one of the cops out there told me that they are stopping early tonight. Typically, they go until 8, but they are uh, cutting off now. They said there was the, the last person that was in line. That was it for the night. And I did call uh, Jeff with gravity diagnostics. He says that that is because of the snow. Now, as for uh, roads out here, I do know that crews are going to be out here working all throughout the night. They switch shifts around midnight, so they will be out here working hard for us. So if you're out there, just be mindful for the crew members that are working and just stay safe and stay slow if you're out on the roads. Guys, I'll send it back to you in the studio. Yeah, I was out at the airport at around one o'clock and the roads weren't treated, but it also was just barely coming down at that point. So hopefully they'll be in control by well, it's rush hour now, so like you said, be safe. And you too, good. Jenna. And Kentucky Governor Andy Bashir told people to not travel in the Commonwealth today if you really don't have to, and he closed all the state office buildings at noon.